Hello again, it's uh, Joey John McGuire. I'm in the um, Plough and Harrow, one of my favourite Weatherspoons pubs. Um, I've been here many times, and I'm about to recite my latest poem, which I wrote, as always, in the early hours of this morning. It's called Brighton Pier. I imagine myself riding, snuggled up and settled on a white cotton summer cloud that seems to be temporarily stuck to the vast bright blue screen that forms the sky. Like a hockney painting, I am frozen in time as I look down upon the coastline which has become a heaving mass of frenzied, homegrown tourists instinctively flocking to the sea's edge, drawn to the smell of the fresh salt in a great escape from the claustrophobic tension of the capital. I can see the multicoloured threads, cars forming traffic, coughing their fumes as they spew out a spontaneous carbon footprint in a mix of hopeful and possibly misguided belief that they will find their little piece of England well before midday, unaware that the beach has already been drowned by the weight of the incoming people. I can hear the shrieks of children playing, all being slowly spit-roasted, because someone has just turned up summer, they being Yorkshire puddings, a fine compliment to a summer's day, which leaves me thinking, that's my England. In reality, I am in fact snoring under my knotted handkerchief, stretching the overworked, striped canvas deck chair, which after I'd scoffed a gut load of fish and chips and demolished a half gallon of warm beer, I'd requisitioned to be my throne on this, my well-fought-for piece of England beside the pier.